Hey besties, welcome back to my channel. I have a lot to tell you guys if you haven't watched my last vlog, but we need to go and pick up a car right now. So I'll talk to y'all about all that once I get into the new car. Okay, y'all, I told you we were renting a car. You're probably like, but Aaron, you have a car. You watched my last vlog, the one where COVID ruined my life. You saw that my car is having some issues right now. Therefore, it can't be driven. So I needed to rent a car. I didn't need to, I wanted to rent a car. Just so I wasn't like cooped up in the house. I've been cooped up for so long and I just need to get some stuff done. I wanna get some stuff done. So that's what we're doing in this vlog. Our first stop is going to be to Ikea. Guys, they finally have the Ikea covet mirror in stock i've been wanting that mirror ever since i moved before i moved actually so they have 11 in stock at this one location so your girl's gonna go it's about a 30 minute drive so it's gonna be a long drive but i'm hoping that it will be worth it um i'll show you guys like the car in a, in a little bit but first we gotta do carplay my bestie carplay at the stop sign turn right then turn right into the parking lot You've entered the parking lot for your destination. I made it to Ikea. I'm not looking around at anything. I don't really think there's anything I really want from Ikea other than my mirror. So I know exactly where to go. If the mirror's not there, I'm going to be depressed. Um, thankfully, the seats came down. I forgot to check that when I was there. But this is a big escape. I wonder if this, maybe this isn't an escape. Is this a row? Uh, I don't know. Got my mask and we out. is the moment of truth to see if they actually have it in stock i think i see it i think this is it yes they have it they have a whole bunch this is more than 11 right this is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 they have 18 so that's good to know sometimes the stock numbers are wrong but yeah this is the mirror this is the cheapest mirror you'll ever find for the size it's huge Y'all, when I tell you this barely fit, literally barely fit. But I did it! Woohoo, I'm so excited! So happy, guys. I can go back home. I think I want to have like spaghetti and garlic bread for dinner. I've been like craving that. Yeah, so I think I might stop at like Meyer, get some garlic bread or whatever, whatever else I need. I don't want to go like grocery, grocery shopping because I kind of want to save that for another day because I want to intentionally choose meals and stuff. <sighs> I'm just so happy. But now I have to drive very carefully, very carefully. Oh my God, I can't wait. I hope I can get this in my apartment and everything. I'm so excited, y'all. I don't think, what do I need? I need garlic bread. <sighs> I have tofu, I have breakfast, sausage. We're gonna go and we're just gonna go in and cut it quick. To be honest, this would have barely fit in my own car. That would have been so annoying if I would have bought it and it wouldn't fit, I would have had to return it. Oh, okay. All right, y'all, we are at one of my favorite, especially here in Illinois, one of my favorite grocery stores, Meyer. You can always, well, normally expect really good produce and things like that. Like I told you guys, I don't really want to go grocery shopping. I'm here to kind of get like a few things. So we'll see, but love Meyer. We have Meyer back home and I was really happy to see that Illinois had one, so. Okay, I know I said I wasn't going grocery shopping, but it kind of looks like I am. They had a lot of stuff that I needed. So it should be like a 30 minute drive back to my apartment. Then I have to load my mirror. So it's gonna be a while until I talk to you guys like for a long time, but fingers crossed that I'm able to get the mirror in the apartment, no problem. Oh, I can't wait. We have so much cleaning to do. Okay, bestie, so I'm here. There are no carts. So I'm gonna have to carry this mirror in there without a cart, which I think I'll be fine. I just have to move fast, but not too fast or so I'll shatter the mirror. Guys, I'm doing it. We're getting there. Don't 
don't let anybody tell you you can't do something. I just brought in 30 pound mirror that's six feet tall by myself. By myself, y'all. Okay, anyway, let's go get our groceries. I don't think I showed you guys this, but when my mom was here, we bought this like little grocery bag. It's really good for insulating stuff when you are uh, like going to multiple stores and also for carrying all your groceries up in one trip. So let's do this. Besties, I'm back. I need to clean my apartment. Um, okay, we're gonna hurry up and go through this grocery haul just so I can like get the mirror unwrapped and everything. It looks good. I don't think there's any shat. Well, obviously it didn't shatter because I would see it. Oh, it's so beautiful. Okay, got some salad. I got these homestyle tortilla chips. I, I really like these. This is what the bag looks like with stuff in it. I got some walnuts for my banana bread. I got some flaxseed milk, some stir fry and fried rice seasoning, buns. I really like these buns. Then we got some sriracha for this garlic bread. I'm probably gonna make that tonight so you guys get to see that. Fresh parsley, that's awesome for the garlic bread. Baked sweet potatoes for me to have baked sweet potatoes during the week. Two limes. I've been like really struggling with finding good juicy limes in Illinois for some odd reason, but Meyer had lots of them. So I got two of them for $1. This is actually a scam, but I wanted to try it. So the little potato, you know, I think this is like the only brand that makes little potatoes. So it comes with the potatoes and then it comes with the seasoning pack. French bread for the garlic bread and also um, gonna try and make a grilled cheese with this. Frozen hash browns and french fries. Then I got some vegetarian products. These are some vegetarian hot dogs, some vegetarian lunch meat. I got these for $2.49. I could have got more, but I was like, Ariana, you're that's being like gluttonous, yada, yada, yada. So I got two. I think I want the mirror to go right here. Um, if I don't like it right here, then it's gonna go in my bedroom so big oh my gosh and i need to figure out i'm not gonna mount it to the wall but i wonder maybe if there's something i can buy to go under the mirror or something that could stick to the wall so i don't have to worry about you know how sometimes when you lay things against the wall it gets a mind of its own and then oh that would be so bad with this mirror that's it's way too expensive for that i guess you guys can finally see how big it is compared to me i'm five seven this has to be five this has to be six feet this is like, I think this is taller than my boyfriend. I think, I haven't seen him in a minute. Justin, you got some competition. Anyway. I keep putting my scissors in dumb places and then I can never remember where I put them. I knew it, okay. I was gonna say, there's no way that this big thing just sits without being mounted at all. At this point, I need an Ikea sponsorship. Well, I don't even have that much stuff from Ikea, but I got the Kalix, I got the Kalix insert, now this. I could totally do this by myself. sideways sorry that's stuff from like christmas i need to put away but i wanted to film it this way so you guys could kind of like see it from my point of view guys it's huge it's so big i do want to figure out mounting logistics because i do feel like maybe at least a nail should be at, at the top but i don't know all right now we're gonna have some nachos as i watch one of my new favorite shows real housewives yeah, of potomac oh lord have mercy karen you want something yeah, I'll take something, Logan. Oh, Y'all have been rocking with me, okay? I told myself this year I would not put myself on the internet like this, but I'm doing it again. Um, I wanted to update you guys on what I've been doing. So I talked to my mom, talked to Justin. Um, I was looking through a magazine and I got this bug to go pick up my mirror. Now, if y'all been watching the moving vlogs, if y'all watched the moving vlogs, that series is like over now. I, you guys remember I got this cute mirror from Home Goods. And I've really been struggling with like putting it up. At first, I was gonna hire a Task Rabbit to do it, but I'm like, I don't. Why would I pay somebody seventy dollars 
to come put this up. I can do it myself. Like, I, I'm pretty handy. So I bought these clips, right? I saw from this TikToker that I follow, she had these clips. They're called clock clips. And basically, it's like a cleaner way to have, like, holes in your walls, blah, 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 blah. Um, and it's easy. Literally, all you do is push this into the wall, drywall, and it goes in and it, like, hooks in. Very, very cool. So I ordered some. But I didn't like how you could see, like, the top of the hook. And I realized today, 60 days later, that it's because I, I got hooks for 65 pounds. That mirror is like 15 pounds at most. So today I ended up ordering some new claws that are going to be here today. So we're going to hang up the mirror today. And um, it'll just show a little bit of the claw, which I'm totally fine with. But yeah, so I... I Ordered that and then I ordered a Nutribullet because I've been wanting smoothies. I don't have a blender, so I will have a blender today as well. So that's what I've been doing. And I also have this weird bug to clean. Normally I like to rest on Saturdays, but if I have this bug, I want to itch it. So we're going to do some cleaning, some straightening up. Um, it's just so funny at the fact that I've lived here for technically 60 days and I still have not unpacked everything, which is funny. But some stuff, I just don't know where to put it. What's next in my cleaning progress? If you guys watched the last vlog, you guys know that I put these together. These are the Ikea Calyx drawers. And the drawers, my intention is to use these for makeup only. I think I wanna keep more of my personal hygiene products either in the bottom row or in my bathrooms. I want this to be makeup only. And these drawers aren't that deep. I'll give you guys a better look but they're not that deep so I don't just want to throw stuff in here so I have five of these that are filled with makeup products this one has um though this is like my miscellaneous one okay like this one has foundations powders con no foundations concealers um some powders and like my sponges right I don't know if all of that can fit in here, but we're going to see. And I think I'm going to be intentional with putting the makeup that I use in here. And then for the makeup that I don't really use, we'll probably keep it in some of these just to have as refills or backups. And also, I have some contact paper. I think that's what they call it. Um, liner paper that I need to actually put in the drawers in my kitchen. I got a cute marble color. And I thought that would actually look really nice in here because the inside, as you guys have seen, is like a just a regular brown let's go get the contact paper and we're gonna cut that put it in here and then we're gonna start to put our makeup in here and I'm not going to, well I don't know if I'm going on a trip anytime soon I'm probably gonna go visit Justin but I don't know I don't know when so the good thing with my trip being canceled I can like fully unpack because I didn't fully unpack so like I'm going on a trip but since I'm pretty sure I won't be going anywhere for the next seven days we can unpack and utilize these drawers Okay, besties, just showing you what it looks like again. I think I need to move this sweater. I think um, I'm going to start putting just a few things in here. Then I'm going to make lunch because your girl is hungry. I was thinking maybe grilled cheese and tomato soup. I think that'd be really good. Okay, besties, this is a very, very simple meal. First, we got the Trader Joe's for the soup. I showed y'all that. Then we're going to use this medium cheddar. Um, I could do a cheddar and Colby Jack mix, but I think I'm just going to go with medium cheddar just for this first time. Then, um, I use this vegan butter. I like it. I really like it. Um, yeah. And then, uh, y'all saw this yesterday. I got this beautiful loaf of French bread. So I'm excited. I actually decided I'm going to do two grilled cheeses, um, just because the, the bread is like small right now. So this one's going to suck. Because, yeah, that one's going to suck. But this one should be a beautiful one. So, looking good. And I did pour my soup into the bowl. I don't, I'm not warming up too much soup because I tend to, like, not finish soup. So, I just did a little bit. If I want more, I can make more. But, yeah. I butter both sides of the bread and I toast both sides. Um, so, I'll show you that when I do that. But we are going to use our vegan butter to butter both sides. And then I'm going to preheat my frying pan.
So I have been neglecting washing my dishes and all that stuff, but I'm gonna do it now. Cause if I don't do it now, I'm gonna push it to tomorrow and I'm not gonna wanna do it tomorrow. So it's cleaning time. I've been burning this candle and I forgot about it and I was like why does my apartment have this weird smell this candle it, it's an interesting smell it smells vanilla latte and maybe it's because I don't really drink lattes but it literally smells like burnt coffee like it doesn't smell like terrible but it smells like a coffee shop and I'm not really into that so we're gonna blow this out and we're gonna try a different candle but yeah literally I, I'm smelling the latte not so much the vanilla I need to get my wick trimmer anyway um, I did get a couple packages, so we're gonna go downstairs to the package room. Okay, besties, I thought all three of my things came in, but only two, so the next thing, it must be up for delivery. First thing that I got is my Nutribullet. Um, so I can't show you guys the front. My address is literally all over the front of this box. But I mean, I'm sure you guys have seen this. Nutribullet Basic Blender. I've been like shopping around for blenders for a while. Um, trying to just find the best price and this one was on my original apartment list So I'll try to have a link down below if you guys are interested in this It's $42 right now. I think it's normally like 67 69 Expect to see smoothies. I want to get this because I want to have more fruit smoothies are really good And I don't really eat breakfast. So I thought this would be a great like way to kind of like encourage me to have breakfast more often and Yeah, so excited for that and then this this is a gift from my mom Basically, it is a duvet cover set. I don't have a comforter as you guys have seen. So this is in the color white because I, I really like white bedding. I have white bedding in my room at home and I really like it. So basically with duvets, you have to put inserts inside of them. So tomorrow or Monday when I go out, I oop, oop, am going to look for an insert. So like right now it's literally just a sheet. So I'm gonna try to find a really thick um, comforter or a duvet insert to go inside of here so that my bed will look nice and fluffy. I definitely don't wanna spend like a lot of money just because if that was the case, I could have just gotten like a really good comforter. So we will see. But yeah, so I think I'm just gonna throw this in the washer right now. Might as well get that out the way. So if I find a comforter, I can put this on my bed tomorrow. Okay, besties, I'm getting ready to mount my mirror on the wall. Let me show you guys what it's gonna look like. So the plan is to put the mirror beautifully in the middle about this high. Okay guys, good news, I have the mirror up. Bad news is I'm gonna take it back down. I think I'm gonna just leave it up overnight, but um, I don't like how you can see the shadow, like there's still space here. So I think I'm going to buy some command hanging strips. So this will be like triple or double reinforced. So it'll be hanging on the hook and then I'm gonna do the hanging command strips. Put those on here so it'll help it stick to the wall 
So it'll, you know, you see all this? I don't like all that. I think it's not a big deal, but I would feel a thousand times more comfortable and then the shadow won't bother me as much. But yeah, I'm proud of myself for getting this done though. So when I look cute tomorrow or the day after that, we can use this as a picture place. But yeah, I'm getting very tired. It's like 10 o'clock. I think I'm gonna go in the bed because we have a lot we need to do tomorrow. So I'll check in with y'all tomorrow. Bye, good night.